Should we do it again? Yeah, of course. Good. Maybe Abu Dhabi. Yes. We deserve a one in Abu Dhabi. Si on vous donnait 10 jours pour retenter votre chance de rentrer dans l'histoire, face à l'homme le plus dominant au monde, que feriez-vous Is Charles Oliveira out of his fight with Islam and is Alex Volkanovski in Yes, all of that is true. My God, what a guy this is. He's just incredible. And this is no disrespect to Oliveira. I'm a little bit more excited for this one. New opponent, same goal. He's the pound for pound number one fighter in the world. He has been as dominant a champion we've seen in a really long time. Okay, they change opponent 10 days before the fight. Who cares? Un premier affrontement déjà entré à la postérité. Volkanovski truly believes that he can beat Islam Mahachev. And he wants to do that. And he wants to show the world, right? He wants to be a two way division champion. Everyone there, you know, we thought we did enough. All other rounds, in my my opinion, I, I win. We all know I want that lightweight belt. You know, we all know I want that rematch. You know, I want that Islam fight. For the first, probably the most anticipated champ for champ rematch in the history of the UFC. Makachev versus Volkanovski for the lightweight title and to discover that is what's at stake. Who is the better fighter? Who truly is the pound for pound number one fighter on the planet? There is fighters, there is champions, and there is elite. My opinion is like Islam is elite in UFC right now. Not many fighters can call them themselves elite. You like or you don't like, I am best fighter in the world right now. Thank you. Son jeu au sol est tout aussi performant que celui de Khabib. Sa lutte est tout aussi performante que celle de Khabib. Mais à côté de ça, il a un striking plus évolué a priori que celui de Khabib. Donc oui, on peut considérer que Makachev, c'est le Khabib version 2.0. He's a better grappler, MMA grappler. Islam, again, he's all about breaking down positions, breaking down, mechanically breaking you down. You know what, Islam's got very underrated striking. That motherfucker is skilled on the feet. Mm -hmm. He's very technical. À 32 ans, Islam Makachev est le successeur des lutteurs venus du Dagestan, une région russe connue grâce à la légende absolue, Khabib Nurmagomedov. He always told me, hey, you have to training and you gonna be champion. В горах мы качались вот камнями, бегали часто в горы, бывало даже три раза в день мы бегали в горы, просто вот камнями качались. Champion du monde, dans la catégorie la plus infernale. L'élève a décidé à présent de dépasser le maître. En fait, pour faire mieux que Khabib, Mahachev devra aller chercher une autre ceinture. Peut-être la ceinture des moins 77 et ça, ça peut arriver assez rapidement. I want to fight for the second book. And you know, who is there? Edwards versus Kobe. I'm really believe I can beat this guy. Mais un homme a décidé de retourner cette ambition contre lui. Monter lui prendre son propre territoire en plus du sien.
Toute sa vie, l'Australien Alex Volkanovski l'a prouvé. Pour lui, rien n'est impossible. And now the man of the match in the grand final for 2011 from the Wurrula Lakes South Gorillas, their prop forward number 10, Alex Volkanovski. Plus personne ne plaisantera à propos d'Alex Volkanovski. En quelques années, il perd son MMA dans les ligues australiennes. He was just finishing up his football season and then he wanted something else to do while he was training in his off season. And I said, come to the gym and give it a crack and see how you like it. And he would always spar the biggest dudes, the hardest dudes, and he would walk right through them. Guys were monsters, but it was good. <laughs> it looked good, the David and Goliath uh, type story, you know what I mean? I had plenty of those moments. I say break, and I mean break, Quand tu as vu Alex fight, tu savais que ce serait la prochaine chose. Même dans les années early days, je pensais que je pouvais faire le UFC, que je pouvais être le UFC champion un jour. D'abord réticente, l'UFC lui ouvre ses portes. Elle a bien fait. En trois ans, il nettoie la catégorie des moins de 66 kg sans jamais perdre. Cette année, d'une agressivité extrême. Octobre 2022, Makachev est à peine titré, alors qu'il pourrait se contenter d'écraser sa catégorie comme la plupart des cracks. Volkanovski est le premier à réclamer sa chance face au nouveau problème du MMA, beaucoup plus lourd que lui. À nouveau, personne ne croit en lui. Volkanovski 
pound for pound best fighter in the world. This is my dream. C'est une victoire à la Rocky, un garçon qui voulait jouer au rugby mais qui était trop petit. À l'âge de 22 ans, il s'est dit bon allez, je passe à autre chose. Il s'est mis au MMA et il est devenu le meilleur combattant de la planète, toutes catégories confondues. Les bookmakers ont en leur favori, c'est Islam Mahachev. Alors on peut comprendre hein, bien sûr, c'est lui le champion de la catégorie lightweight. Il aura un avantage de gabarit sur son adversaire. I want a finish. Go there and shock the world. I'm prepared to go five rounds of war. Every second I'm gonna try to finish him, but my goal, I want to knock him. Makachev va très rapidement le comprendre. Ça ne va pas se passer comme prévu. See this movement. This is key for Volkanovski. Can he continue doing it for 25 minutes? If this guy stays on the feet, we have a new double champ. If this lad Makachev can take him down, he defeats him. I need to turn up. You know, I always prepare how I should, and uh, I plan on uh, raising two belts at the end of it. Well, He's gonna take his whole energy, take him down, and he's gonna choke him out. Well, this is a face crank or a neck crank, extremely painful. Like you need to literally kill me, or like you, know, you need to put me right out. Never give up attitude. He's good at holding people down, but I don't think he has good submission. As soon as he grabbed me down, it was game over. I told you that wasn't going to happen. Après quatre rounds sur cinq, Volkanovski est mené, cadenassé. Ça suffit. You know, I'm like that, so I'm just going. Look at you, just trying to survive. You said you'll finish me. You're not even trying to go for the finish. Is this all you got? You're just trying to survive. You know what I mean? Just hanging on for dear life. Come on, you little. I thought, hey, wrestling, grappling, improve. Let's do something. Move. Il reste cinq minutes. Pas le choix. Il faut finir le monstre. Might be too soon. Yeah, I know it's definitely up. Okay, bet. Right, one more. Let's go. One more round. Last round. This is it. Last round. He's going to try to shoot again anyway. He's getting tired. He fact, his legs are a bit gassed for you. Let's go. Last round is me. Yeah. He's going to go, brother. Time's a bit down. Look like you're going upstairs. Allez, l'histoire s'écrit, l'histoire de l'UFC pour le meilleur combattant de la planète, Championship Round. C'est la dernière reprise entre Volkanovski, le combattant numéro 1, pound for pound, de l'organisation face au numéro 2, Islam Makachev. His striking, Machev's striking, is the best it's looked, and it's because he's been forced to strike. Nobody's been able to keep it on the feet, but you're seeing how good he is now. Nice. But look at this. Beautiful striker. I mean, that is in, in itself so impressive. You know what I mean? Like, even when he had me, I'm not down. Oh, you're not that strong. Puissance tout de même de Volkanovski, malgré le fait qu'il soit catégorie poids plume. On le sent, hein, il a énormément de force, hein, Taylor. 
If Fox gets back up after a takedown, that's going to shatter his confidence in a huge way. My mind when the fight is finished, I know minimum I won three rounds. This is so short and hard opponent. Thank you, Alex. Thank you. It was a fun fight, you know. Um, maybe I could have capitalized in some positions a bit more. Um, left it a little late, but hey, what do you do? Congrats uh, to Islam. Bro, he lost that fight, I believe. Volkanovski showed more technique. He did it. 96 significant strikes to 141 for Volkanovski. A lot of people have said this Islam kind of won the fight, but. Volk's stock just went so uh, so much higher after this one. <laughs> he told so nervous and he said, why you don't do this, this, this? He said, if you come to and you, if you was my corner, I can do this, but you didn't come. I can say pretty surely that that was the best champion versus champion fight that we have ever seen. And I took part in one. Soyons clairs. Oui, pour certains, Alex Volkanovski est fou de retenter le coup dix jours avant. Mais Islam Marachev, lui aussi, prend un risque énorme. Un adversaire différent au dernier moment pas du tout celui qu'il a préparé. Peu importe. Le samedi 21 octobre 2023, sur les coups de 22h30, il sera temps d'écrire en lettres d'or ce qui pourrait devenir la rivalité ultime du MMA. Dix jours seulement pour se préparer à l'histoire. Last time, Islam flew down to Australia, into Volkanovski's backyard. Now it's the exact reverse, okay? Volkanovski's flying into Abu Dhabi, kind of his backyard, as people have been calling it. So you've got to think about it, the David Goliath story, this massive underdog moving up a division, you know what I mean? Like the narrative going into this, is if Volkanovski pulls it off, which will be an absolute miracle. C'est pas quelque chose que tu improvises. Je ne vois pas en, en, en l'espace de même pas dix jours d'être physiquement prêt. I'm still going to go with Islam. He won the first fight. You have to go that way on, on this fight. And as far as odds go, I think Islam will be a favorite, but not as big as he was last time. This guy really tough. If you want to stop him, you have to choke him or knock him out. Volk, Charles, doesn't matter. Islam is a world champion right now. 
If King Kong can make 155, okay, bring this guy here. If Islam wins, then it will go down in history that once and for all, Islam is the better man. That if he loses to Islam twice in a row, then he ain't gonna get another shot. Don't be scared of a challenge, you know what I mean? Because it's only gonna make you better.